started competing in fitness competitions in 1991. And in 1995, I won my first pro fitness show. And in 1998, I won the Fitness Olympia. Um, both shows were amazing for me to win. I was uh, quite surprised that, that I won the shows. Uh, my training for those was quite different than how it is now because I was doing fitness. So I had to prepare a routine to compete on stage with, which uh, involved a lot of gymnastics training. So the fitness involved a lot of gymnastics training and my training in the gym was limited because of the, the gymnastics that I, that I had to do to prepare for fitness. Uh, I was in the gym probably two times a week other than the gymnastics training. Um, I quit competing in fitness in 1999 and in 2003 I decided to go ahead and do figure competitions. So since 2003 till now, my training has been really um, different from my fitness competition days. So I don't do any gymnastics anymore, but I do a lot of functional training now. Uh, I still sprint at the track. That's one of the things I never quit doing from when I was a, a child in school. So I go to the track probably once or twice a week and do a good sprint plyometric workout. Uh, I do functional training, like I said, and I'm in the gym probably twice a week right now, training shoulders and back. And I do um, I do a lot of cardio, so I'm, I'm usually doing cardio anywhere from five to seven days a week. And I do a lot of interval training and some steady, steady pace as well. So I really tailored my workouts now to what, just to maintain the physique that I have and I enjoy a lot of different activities, so it's been uh, fun being able to try all the different workouts that's available now.